Hey everybody, this is Jamie Buter, and I have finally gotten to the bottom of why my, my YouTube channel is blocked in the United States, and you're not going to believe this. All right. It arises from a divorce proceeding between Dr. Leonard Horowitz and Jacqueline Lindenbaugh, his ex-wife. Okay, what this, what this court order here is, and I finally got it from YouTube, what this court order here is, is actually, it's an order approving stipulation. Okay, the divorce has already taken place. This is an order approving stipulation, which means that what it does is it dissolves, or what it, it, the, it's an order dissolving how their business interests that they had together are, are going to be dissolved, okay? Leonard G. Horowitz, is his company was the Royal, the Royal Bloodline of David LLC, right? And uh, his ex-wife is the Manifestation of Divine Will LLC, right? It's all, in this, it's all in this court order. Case number, State of Ohio, County of Bonner. Now, how... How does my website, our, my websites and, and YouTube channel get taken down or blocked through a, a stipulation of a divorce proceeding? I mean, they're also talking about, well, it's not just between the companies, it's a talking about child custody of what Aaron Horowitz, who gets custody of Aaron Horowitz. It's in here. Now, what I'm showing you here is Exhibit B. Now, let me, let me get to that. Let me read you guys this here. It's uh, paid, or, uh, paragraph 10 and 11. It is further ordered... That to the extent Horowitz, Kane, Lindenbach, the Lindenbach entities and or the Horowitz entities maintain or exercise any direct or indirect control over any websites, web pages, social media pages, uh, blogs, uh, web based videos or any media of any kind whatsoever that in any way would violate the terms or conditions of this injunction reference in the next above paragraph, said party shall immediately take all necessary steps to remove, delete or otherwise close down and eliminate such media so that such removal occurs no later than 10 days from the date of the entry of this order. Number 11, it is further ordered that to the extent any such website, web page, social media page, blog page, web based video, or any other media outside the direct or indirect control of Horowitz, Kane, Lindenbach, and Ent Horowitz entities and Lindenbach entities, the receiver shall submit a request ex parte. Uh, entry of order or orders from this court to determine such media shall be in violation of this order which order or orders the receiver shall serve upon the owner, operator, or ISP with regard to any such disparaging media outside the control of the parties. And then they further state, okay, um, uh, if, um, uh, Jacqueline Lindebach will submit Exhibit B of all the websites she wants taken down, and Leonard G. Horowitz uh, emits or um, submits Exhibit B of all the websites he wants taken down. Now, Exhibit B, which I have, I only printed off the one that I'm on, but there's 15 pages. It's over 200 websites and pages that Leonard Horowitz was able to submit to a court to have taken down, to be shut down or blocked through a divorce proceeding. And it's in here. I mean, this is it. So that is how my YouTube channel and hundreds of other websites were taken down by, by uh, Leonard G. Horowitz here. Okay. Now, Leonard Horowitz is a public figure. He has books in the public domain. Essentially, what this order does is it shuts everybody up that he wants to. You realize he can submit anything to the court and say, hey, these people are disparaging, right? It essentially silences anybody who speaks against Dr. Leonard Horowitz. It, it effectively silenced all these detract everybody. Leonard Horowitz is free to do whatever he wants now. Nobody can speak up about it because their, their websites get shut down, all right? So anyway, all happened in a divorce proceeding. Now, I can't post this online because it has... It has information in here, uh, mailing addresses and emails and stuff like that. So I'm already in enough uh, trouble with YouTube with this thing. They, YouTube sends me a thing saying that we don't offer legal advice. Maybe you should really think about what you put up on, on YouTube. So, you know, I mean, it was like, wow, they never even read the order. I mean, it was just a divorce. It's an order approving stipulation. Out, I mean, it's a, a separate order outside of the divorce explaining how do web pages get taken down. That's, I mean, that's just amazing to me. So anyway, if you don't like it, Talk to uh, Judge Barbara Buchanan. Here's the address to the courthouse. All right. So if you guys want to uh, give her, write her a letter and ask her how uh, hundreds of pages get taken down in a divorce proceeding and a cu child custody uh, agreement, um, it would be interesting to listen to her answer. Because I, what happened? I mean, I don't know. I hate to even stipulate what took place in order for that to, this to take place. So anyway. I just wanted to get that out, finally got down to the bottom of it, but now you know. So thanks for watching.